I want to say I'm so thankful. This is to that 4C type of hair, honey. You can smash it down as far as it will go and make it look as short as you want to or stretch it out as long as it will go. I have my week all planned out. I have my videos already recorded in Facebook and all I had to do was download them to my computer and edit them and repost them in YouTube. But I changed my Facebook password and I don't remember it. I have to find out where I wrote it down. I'm sure Google knows it, Alexa, Siri, everybody but me. <laughs> but in honor of Black History Month, <clears throat> I wrote a poem titled, I'm Not Tired. You know, last couple of days, I've watched a few old movies. One of them was a movie that Cicely Tyson played in, Sounder. And the other one was, I Know Why the Cage Bird Sings. And then I watched a couple of YouTube videos <clears throat> last night and they were titled The Most Dangerous Ways to School, something of that manner. And it showed these children who lived in Nicaragua who had to go through extreme cases just to get to school and what they had to go through. And uh, I'm reminded of the fact that everybody, no matter what you think, everybody has to go through something in life, no matter how much money they come from. Sometimes the more people have, and the more spoiled they are, well, I, I'm not speaking from experience, but sometimes I believe the more people have, the harder it is for them. They find themselves with too many options and strung out on drugs and just partying a life of just whatever they want, whenever they get ready. And I don't, I don't know. I don't think that that's always the best thing. So I just want to encourage anyone that listens, anyone that sees this video, whatever the circumstance you are in, that when you get tired, because I believe we all get tired sometimes, no matter how great other people may think our life may be or how it looks like on the outside, we all get tired. And I hope that this poem that I wrote today in honor of our black history will be a blessing to anyone who hears it. I'm not tired. Sometimes I write. I fight with my pencil or pen. Sometimes I win. One day, I want to be white so I can see just how much easier life can be. I want to know the privilege. Mm, I'm not tired of being me. I just want to see, you know, then I'll turn back black. It sure would have been different if all my ancestors were born free. Oh, I woke up this morning with something to say. But I'm not tired. My soul just needs some rest. Yesterday, I watched a video on YouTube titled, The Most Dangerous Ways to School. I thought to myself, those kids need the internet. Before I lift my head out of the bed, those kids have washed up, fed the animals, beat their clothes clean and ate more than what some of us do in a day. No, I'm not tired.
tired? Couldn't be. Sometimes if you see what other people have to go through, it will give you strength. You have to admit to yourself, what do I really have to complain about? Hmm. You see, I'm doing good. You can't see my struggle or my fight. So no, I'm not tired. My soul just needs rest from injustice. I once read excerpts from a book called When I Was a Slave. No, I, I never had to get up for 20, 30, 40 years for crack of dawn and work in a field with snakes, rats, and mice while the hot sun baked me and some fell dead. I ain't tired yet. I had to tell myself there's so much more that I can do, so much difference that I can make. In Nicaragua, some child's educational materials cost $41 a year. The price I would pay for a nice pair of shoes. In third world countries, it costs $300 for surgery that gives sight to the blind. I'd like to give that to somebody so they can see. What a beautiful Christmas present that will be. All my life, I've been living a dream, born free, and I'm grateful, so very grateful. It's just that everything, every day is still a fight. Right has become wrong, Wrong has become right. Oh, what some would give to be in my shoes. They say, girl, what kind of problems you got? I wish I had those kind of problems. It's just that everything I aspire to do and to achieve is a fight. Every single thing. You know, life will wear you out. When you are young and full of energy and life, all those aspirations help you take flight. You set your mind on things you desire and want to achieve. Mount up on eagle's wings and fly. Then the strong wind blows and toss you about or a storm comes, even a predator, and tries to take you out. Whew, by the time your life is halfway over, it seems you wonder if it was worth a dream. It takes so much just to maintain. You find yourself wanting simple things like peace, joy, and happiness. And knowing that whatever your situation, whatever your circumstance, you are blessed. You ain't tired. No. Your soul just needs rest.
I'm not tired of giving my best. The enemy knows I'm blessed. So in this fight called life, I'm not tired. Sometimes my soul just needs a little rest. By Monica Khan Hill. I, the Lord, thy God, will hold thy right hand, saying unto thee, fear not. I will help thee. God bless you.